Hey guys, welcome to part 15 of Let's Play Metroid Fusion for the Game Boy Advance. And this will also be found on GameOne.com. We saw in the last part, we finally found the source of the, uh, of all the roots that are choking up the main power silo, and now we've got it all flushed out. As you can see, the whole area looks a bit more relaxing. Not so many roots choking up the place. Still lots of enemies though, but that's to be expected. And at least the hatches are working too. What if I went this way first? Oh, you gotta love this plasma beam piercing right through enemies. I'll just go back to the right and take the other door. Uh, another one of these rooms, these stupid enemies. Why are they here? What purpose do they serve? Mm, I guess I can go back to like the uh, main power silo. I mean, I could do that. Can I? Can I do that from here? Uh, no, I can't actually. It's actually one way. So I have no choice. I have to go back to the main area. Actually, it could have been faster. I don't know. There's actually a little room that I couldn't get to before. Maybe I can now. Oh, yes, I can. Oh, it's this room. I remember this. You need really good skill with your missiles here. And I don't think I did it. Nope, no, no, I didn't. Wait, 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 I got it, I got it. First try, too. I remember practicing this. This took like lots of tries. Way too many. Like, it just got tedious in a hurry. But at least I got two packs of power bombs for it. Two for the price of one for a very difficult task. Well, it's difficult for some people. It's difficult for me, shut up. But if you got it on your first try every time, well, congratulations, good for you. Not everyone is blessed with the same skill that you might have. Anyways, let's just go. I could use more energy, that's why I'm gonna take some time to kill more enemies. I mean, even though I got the Varia suit, it seems like every time I take a single hit, I lose a lot more damage than I'm gaining from numerous enemies. It just seems that way. I'm not sure if that's exactly the case, but it gives you that feeling. Like, if you get lots of health and you take like one hit, it gets you nowhere fast. I was going I was going the right way the whole time. Why didn't I shoot that? Oh, there's a recharge room. That should help. That's much better. Save of course. Alright. In the navigation room again. What? You restored plasma beam functionality? Most unexpected. Even so, continue to avoid the SAX. It too may be stronger. You still lack a few abilities crucial to survival. Wait, wait a second. More trouble. Hold on. I've isolated the cause. There's been an explosion in the ARC data room. Samus, go to Sector 5 for like the third time. The damage is staggering. Find out what's causing it. Oh gee, I wonder what it is. I guess it starts with an N and ends in a nightmare. Would that be a possible answer to what we're looking for? Huh? Huh? It could be. I mean, 
I saw something flying around, which was big, and a ball sack hanging out. He thinks that would be pretty dangerous, but you might find it completely harmless in your secret of mind, I don't know. But I guess we're gonna have to butt heads about it, aren't we? It's gotten worse. Damage seems to have been caused by a creature kept here by the researchers who named it the Nightmare. Apparently, it was a biomechanic mechanical organism designed for military applications. It possesses uncommon power and can manipulate gravity. We must assume that the next host. We have no choice. We must find it and defeat it. I can't confirm the location. It sends out of control, hurry, but destroys the entire station. And believe me, that boss has the capability to do that. It's pretty nasty. I mean, a lot of people have found it very notorious for difficulty. But you know what? It hasn't dealt with me. Actually, it has at one point. But that was years ago. A lot has changed since then. Oh yeah, the damage is so obvious. I mean, all we gotta do is follow the signs of the destruction. Wait, can I get up there? Oh, I guess I can. Oh, what is in there anyway? Actually, there's numerous things to look for. I guess I can do a bit of exploring before I take on my hair. Whatever, whatever exploring I can do. Hmm, looks like I've got to keep the fire in the water now. Maybe I should get out. What the? Amphibious space pirates, not good. Maybe I can keep going. I mean, since I'm going up, I'll avoid the water. Let's do that. Actually, I think charged plasma shots would do the job much better against these guys. Does nothing against these enemies for some reason. I guess they're armored. Yeah, maybe I should find a save room first. He thinks that would be a very good plan. Okay, there's something good in here. Where is it? Ah! Over here. Alright. Back in the face of danger. Yeah, I can't go this way, of course. But I guess I can go up here. Uh, I don't want to go this way yet, that's a boss. Better find a save room first and take it from there. Okay, something to fall back on. I don't want to progress through all this again. Hmm, look at all the destruction it caused. Alright, let's do this. Okay. Ooh, energy tank, but don't be fooled. Okay, I'm gonna start the video here a little early, but stay tuned for the next part when I take on Nightmare. See ya, everybody.